My name is Joe. My name is Yatin. We're here to demonstrate airway cuff pressure management. This is our colleague, Mr. Fire Marshal Bill. Per the hat. No. This is a this is his tracheostomy tube that we're going to be inflating. And right here is the cuff, this small bag balloon type part to the uh, tracheostomy tube. This is actually the pilot balloon, which is the only actual balloon on here. This is inflated, and this inflates the actual cuff. And the equipment um, that um, we use to um, inflate the, uh, the balloon here um, is uh, called um, cufflator. And basically what it does is it just gives us the measurement on, on, on how much pressure we have on the cuff. Um, and we want to keep it somewhere over here um, in the green, um, green zone over here. Uh, usually it's better if we keep it down um, towards the um, higher end of the green zone. So even if you have a little bit of leakage um, on um, you know air leakage on um, on a um, on a um, uh, cuff, um, we are still um, safe over there. So we'll basically um, keep it over here in the green you know, upper side of the green green zone. Um, and the procedure we'll do is uh, we'll sh we'll show right now what we're gonna do. Uh, we'll first um, go ahead and um, scrub in, put our gloves on. Uh, do the asepsis, you know, we're just going to wash our hands, make sure everything is all yeah, nice and clean. Gotcha. And I don't have my gloves in. Put our gloves on. Um, insert, insert the um, the tracheostomy tube into um, to the stoma over here. So this is what it is. Gonna go ahead and um, inflate the cup now. Cuff now. Come on, I first squeeze it. I'm gonna try to bring it up to about 50. Kind of overshoot it a little bit. And you want to squeeze gently because, as I've done before, it'll shoot to 100 if you squeeze too hard. So. Gentle, oh, good job. All right, I'm going to back off now with this red button. I'm going to try to bring it down to. Okay, now I'm still in that green area, so that's that's about as much as I want to have in there. So this way, since like my associate said, we have room for leakage. So I'm just going to pull the pilot balloon off. Well. And do so without squeezing it. I'll let go. Test the pilot balloon, make sure it's still full. That way you know that it's not leaking. And, and it's, as we can see, obviously before it was flat and now you know, it has air in there. It's um, the pressure that we put in there and the um, cuff inside, it's all um, inflated. And I had it at about 24, 25 centimeters of water. So that's, I'll document that in the book, you know, just as far as how much air I put into the, in the, the cuff itself. I'll put that in the orders. And that's and it. And that's it. That's the uh, cuff pressure management procedure.